This is the mindfulness one and it uses shells and this concept of um, an opaque bag and a mindfulness principles worksheet and um, talking about what mindfulness is and really introducing the concept and having clients use an actual shell to feel and explore the concept of mindfulness. I'm So Sticky is a really great interactive one and this is um, talking about the possible alternatives to um, using as far as like pain management because life gets sticky and it can be painful and so the question is what do we tend to do when we feel sticky is it a feeling we like to have for long we just want to wash it off and cover it up and so sometimes people use substances as a way and so we try to in a, in a sort of a contest like manner stick as many things as we can onto a piece of duct tape and then we just break it out and um, just really check out and look at the mental emotional physical stickiness conversation dream catchers um, a wonderful exploration, something that the client can take with them. And we're using evidence-based treat models with mindfulness and really asking the question um, about full acceptance and, um, and then breaking down um, the seven elements of mindfulness. Music Challenge is one of my favorite things. Um, we use the song from um, USA Africa from the 80s. And I love challenging clients to try to listen to that song with a brand new perspective. And it's just not really easy. And they start to realize how we get so used to certain things and um, how important it is to have a beginner's mind when we're starting something new. Like I said, the second section is relapse justification. Um, just stop justifying. And um, we do these um, cutouts from magazines and talk about internal and external influences. And you, we break them down to one side is what, what comes from an internal urge to um, relapse versus external. Um, serial is sober. I absolutely could not believe these people blew me away with their creativity. And um, the, the purpose is to equip clients with life structuring skills through an activity which stresses all aspects of sobriety and recovery process. And so we just start talking about cereal and I give out a cereal box and they make a sobriety and recovery cereal box and they label the different sides according to the instructions and they really are able to artistically formulate a plan. It's so cool how that turns out. Um, uh, the intervention three is on pain-focused discharge planning. And so we know that a lot of people use because of pain in their lives and they're trying to either um, buffer or cover over physical pain, emotional pain, or psychological pain. And um, we talk about chains and those chains that hold us back. And the, the chain word breaking down into choice, habit, automatic identity, and nature. And building these chains up and then tearing them down and letting them see the freedom visually through art. And so these go on and on. They're all really good. I love this one. Unique as a snowflake using the seasonally, using something like in the winter um, about snowflakes. Daily dedication, so being really compliant with your recovery. Um, he, I love this one too. So when they're getting ready to go on an overnight or they're going away for a holiday and maybe they're new in their sobriety, what do I need to make sure that I have packed my recovery compliance overnight bag? And say so like, what is the one thing that you would never travel without for an overnight trip? Well, let's talk about what that relates to as your sobriety. You've got this, another seasonal activity, um, small pumpkins in the fall. Um, summer reframing fashionably, literally using um, sunglasses and discussing what vision is and how do we change our worldview, especially as it relates to sobriety. Um, the soundtrack record of your life. What is the messages that you're hearing over and over again? Um, this is a family systems one I love. Here's another um, food related one. This one's called one slice at a time. So just taking your addiction a little bit at a time and asking each person to make a slice of pizza and put them all together inside of a box. So cool. Um, fresh for Christmas time, holiday time, making ornaments out of freshly caught um, tree slices. And they really start to think about how raw their life really is and sanding down those edges and making them beautiful and restarting. Um, souls with holes, great work. Um, story prompting art, just something very fluid and wonderful. And then here's our worksheets. So the back of the book just has everything you need, the worksheets for you to print, copy, um, draw on the board. And um, I think this is just a really great tool for you to use and I hope you love it.